That's it. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Welcome to my channel. Vlog live twenty four seven. <laughs> wow, we're looking for a good place to cross, isn't it? It's like it's everywhere, isn't it, Gil? It's like it's everywhere. We're trying to cross this water here. It's a fast running water and it's not giving us a little gap that we can just walk over. Oh, he said here. Oh my days. Yeah. Oh. Oh man. Made it. Is this worth it? I'm not sure now. It's hard work. Need a break, man. Wow. I'm glad the kids didn't come now. No way. This is a nightmare. Ethan couldn't take this. It's cool here now. This is heavy, heavy, heavy stuff, man. Heavy, heavy, heavy. Just waiting for these guys to come up. They're a bit behind. So get a little break. But they're gonna want a break as well. I'm sure they're not just gonna kick off. I hope we're walking up this bit. It's nice and cool, isn't it, Jeff? Yeah, yeah. Hope this is the bit that we're gonna walk. Lovely cool breeze now. Hope we're going up this way. Hope we're going up this way. Part two. Look at the view, it's beautiful, isn't it? Look. It's gorgeous. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like a right hiker now. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Don't step on that one. Yeah, don't step on the red one. The red one's loose, guys. On the on the right, on your right. I nearly found out the hard way. Where's Jen? Oh. Thank you. Well, wow, don't step on the red one, yeah? On the right, on your right. It's loose. No. Don't step on the red one. Yeah, it's loose. I stepped on it. Caught me. We wanted to go to Mount Pinatubo, and that's what we're doing. We're getting to Mount Pinatubo. This is a once-in-a-lifetime thing. Now we're crossing this stream, guys. Do you think Stephen would do this? Stephen and Mike? Mike would. <sighs> Stephen would, but. You're at my. Huh? Lucky you got those, isn't he? I haven't got any. These are waterproof. Uh. Look at that! There's a little dog up here. They said it was going to be a high of 32 degrees. Oh, I'm going to lose some weight. This is a this is a trek. Absolutely gorgeous. This is my stick. There's one problem. 
problem with all of this. We have to come back. Getting there is one thing, but there's no easy way back. So, the only good thing is that you're going downhill while we're going uphill at the moment, which is always a little bit harder. Another fast stream. We've got to cross everywhere you go. Fast running stream. Look at that. I'm sure there's been some slides. Isn't it? When it's raining heavy and it just falls down, that's what all that is, isn't it? Landslide. Couldn't come up here when it's raining, I'll tell you that. You don't know what could happen, yeah? Looks like the sun's starting to come out again. Wow, another stream. So many of these things. The only good thing, it washes off all the dirt, but then it doesn't last too long. As it gets dirty again, so I clear my toes of all the grit, then suddenly I'm back in it again. See, I've got all grit in there again. It's just loads and loads of boulders and rocks and stones. Look at this, real prehistoric stuff here, I tell you that. I wonder for the colour of this one. Sulphur. Oh, that's sulphur, guys. That's the orange colour. Sulphur. See, coming down from the mountain. Seems like we're getting nearer and nearer. Because now we're seeing sulphur in the water. I think them guys, they go fast. So they can get a longer rest. Waiting for the people at the back to catch up. That's clever, isn't it? What's with this? There's a village in the inside. They all eat us living there. Oh, hey guys. They eat us living there. Hello guys, we are 2.5 kilometers to the crater, so we're just at a little stop here, all of us just having a little break. I should sit down really, my feet are killing me. So this stop is right by the Itas where they have their little village, near the top of Mount Pulatubo. So they're up there, near the center of the picture, there is a cave. This is just drying their clothes. So they've washed their clothes and they just put them out to dry on the rocks. And, uh, but they actually live up, up there. They climb up there somehow. And there's two ladies there having something to eat just by the running water, lovely. I was gonna try and get a picture of them, but this is us here. Oh look, there's Anita there, she's there. Sister there, selling some stuff. There's a little cutie there. That's the la lady there, selling stuff. So, uh, I think we're on the move again now. <laughs> I hope so. I think so. It's warm. The water's warm. Yeah. Here, yeah, all the sulfur guys. Hello. <laughs> Jesus God. Halfway. Oh shit. Oh, we're nearly there. That is far. Rest, rest, rest. Wow. I don't like the look of that. I'm going around this way. That looks a bit, bit high for me. We get so much stones. There's a bayou cool over there. That's a break stop. I'm gonna be the first one there, so I can get a break first. Wash the grit off my shoes, and then get back into the grit. Back into the water. When the guy said there were loads more streams, he was right. There are loads of them. I prefer when it's cooler, then I can move. It's when that hot heat hits you. you just can't do anything. 2.3 kilometers. But what makes it longer is the no roughness of it. It's so rough. It's so rough. God, the has gone up there. She's not stopping. Look at that, beautiful. Look at those like caves there. Wow. Oh, there's another biocool one there. I think they're definitely gonna stop there. Look, I've come the wrong way. That's the thing. 
if you stay with the guide, they guide you to the to the right uh, path to walk. Because you end up doing it on your own. You don't have way to go. I'm just looking for the quickest route. So steep. That's the other thing. It is so steep. Yeah, it is, isn't it? And we still got a long way to go. Oh my days. Let's take a break, man. I'm the shade, isn't it? Mom. Yeah. 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 We're at the Mount Pinatubo Lake. Eh, never thought we'd make it, but we did. Got to the lake. Hello, everybody. Come on. Me and Mahal, we made it to Mount Pinatubo Lake, and it was a trek. But look at this view. Wow, the sun's starting to come out. Now it was raining earlier on, but now the sun is starting to come out. Look at the view of this wonderful lake. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's massive and it spirals round the corner. It doesn't just come here. What you're seeing isn't it. Oh, what's that big flying insect? It actually meanders round the bend there. I don't know where it goes there, but we're just here. There's no boats on here. No boats allowed, obviously. The water is very calm, very still. Obviously there's no running water because there's nothing for it to run down into. It's just a massive crater with lots of water in it. You can smell the, what's it called? Sulfur, that's it. Well done. You can smell the sulfur. Wow, you can smell it. You've got, you got these reeds in here inside the lake. It's absolutely wonderful. My house dipping her feet in there. this put all the stones together it's supposed to be good luck if you put a stone there you sure need it here bit of good luck in it guys <laughs>
people on there to a bit of life now. Tricycles, motorbikes. So we know we're getting back to life, back to normality. We got cows grazing, goats. So now we're coming down to down to earth, as they say. Lots of animals grazing, look at them grazing away. Not a care in the world. Right, ruts in there, isn't it? Try and avoid them. This is like a rally car, you know. <laughs> wow, well, it reminds me of Dubai. Going up in the dunes, then you go up, and then you come down. Tricycles riding along here. I don't know how they do it. Morning, everybody. It's another day. It's another day in the Philippines and also another day after Mount Pinatubo yes we made it we're home and it's another day <laughs> wow that's really good I'll take your video while he's going in there please Lord give me a I be the greatest. Everybody on the face shit. I look around and feel like everybody is the fakest. I make this every day and I'm impatient. Hoping one day I blow up from the basement. Stay